Hello everyone, this is Lakshman. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In the today's session, I am going to explain how to learn any programming language as a non-IT engineer. So if you are from non-IT background, this video is very helpful. How to learn any programming language? What are the steps you should follow to learn any programming language within six or eight months? Okay, so lakhs of students used to ask me, so how to learn a new programming language as a non-IT background. Okay, so even uh, this video is helpful for IT background as well who are uh, enter into the IT field. So I mean, who want to start career in IT field. So there are eight steps are there you should follow to learn any new programming language as a non-IT engineer. The first one is pick any one programming language either java or python or c sharp or javascript which are most uh, uh, demand in the it market okay so it is uh, depends on your interest before choosing any programming language first aware of that programming language where we used uh, the particular programming language and what type of uh, projects or softwares are developing using the specific programming language Okay, so before choosing any technology or programming language, first understand that uh, specific programming language, how much demand in the IT market, that particular language. After choosing a specific programming language, you have to focus on fundamentals concept. Here fundamentals means in any programming language, the basic concepts are like uh, variables, methods, okay or functions control statements okay loops arrays these concepts are uh, common for any programming language but the syntax wise different but the concept is same irrespective of programming language so that is the reason if you do practice a lot of practice in this area basic areas okay then you will gain confident yes i can become a programmer many of the candidates are skipping these areas the fundamentals concept and they are directly jump into the advanced concept then you feel that uh, i am not good fit uh, this programming language even non it background candidates also if you have problem solving skills and the logical thinking mind then you can become a programmer and you will get a good job in IT market. But only thing is required, the planning. What programming language I should choose and how to prepare that particular language. I'm telling once again, guys, be focused on these basic fundamentals concepts. Do a lot of practice. Okay, you have to choose different examples, different programs on these concepts, variables, methods, control statements, loops, arrays concept. So while you are learning these concept, basic concept, choose small problems. I mean, choose the small programs. Okay, understand the logic, what it is, what I have to give input, and what is processing, what I can expect output entire software field is depends on this concept only what you are going to input how it is processing and what we can expect output this thing only input processing and output there are three types of problems are there like a small problems medium problems and a complex problems first you have to practice on small problems only then medium type problems then complex problems okay and then the next step is Keep note down important points or problems. So whenever you are practicing, so please keep note down that logic. So if you are stuck in some way, you can ask your uh, friend or siblings or colleagues. So you have to make it habit, uh, keep note down important points and uh, important problems. Okay. And the next thing is, this is very important. Be consistent while you are learning programming language. Why I am telling, why I am pressing here, you know. So many of the candidates, they are doing the uh, mistake, you know. Uh, first two days, they are doing practice. And again, they are skipping two days. 
after that again they are uh, continue learning so if you follow this process you may not become a programmer so you have to do minimum two to three hours daily practice so if you want to become a programmer within six to eight months whether you are non-IT or IT okay if you are passing some days and then learning uh, some days it's not going to work out okay and then approach brilliant coder so you have to approach some uh, brilliant or uh, who are good in programming or good in coding you just make the connections through linkedin or some other social networks okay so if you raise any doubts or any any topic they may solve your problem okay and then the next point is always think about real problems okay so you have to think about the problems what are the uh, real problems in our uh, society i mean in software mind i mean software problems okay how we can solve that problems okay so at least minimum six to eight months you must always think about the software real problems and how you can achieve those and how you can solve those problems okay and then the next point is do practice two to three hours daily do practice two to three hours daily so if you don't practice at least two hours then it is very difficult to become a programmer okay and one more thing guys while you are focusing on any two to three hours per day and don't use any uh, social networking websites at that time while you are learning so it may disturbing your mind just focus on what you are going to solving the problems okay so nothing guys whatever the real problem is there you have to divide that problem and make it small and you can solve that problem and it is very easy even non-IT students even non-IT engineers as well only one thing is required that is your determination and dedication no one can help you guys you have to do yourself and also you can uh, improve your uh, network in your relevant skills through linkedin okay these are the main points to learn any programming language as a beginner just focus on fundamentals concept that is enough to enter into the it field so if you are a experienced candidate up to two to three years then you, you must be focused on fundamentals as well as one framework that relevant uh, particular programming language so if you are very strong in fundamentals then you can easily get the job everyone skipping fundamentals concept these are the only fundamentals concept like variables methods control statements loops arrays so these are the main things to understand the any programming language understand the concept so that's all guys if we have any doubts on this session please uh, comment in the comment section i will reply to your queries and, and don't forget please like the button and and share to your friends also i am expecting this video to reach more and more people uh, for non-it engineers who are struggling how to learn any new programming language okay i hope this video is very helpful so we will meet in the next video thank you very much